Okay, this is a video uh, put together by Livingston Garden Machinery and it's really uh, to try and help people identify areas um, where they're perhaps uh, checking the oil incorrectly uh, or at least uh, bringing their attention to checking oil more regularly. Okay, uh, first thing is this is a, a general sort of lawnmower. Uh, the lawnmower is manufactured by Honda uh, and the engine is also manufactured by Honda. You may have a lawnmower that has a Honda engine uh, fitted to it and it may be manufactured by another uh, maker. Okay, the first thing to clearly identify is that it's important to look at your instruction manual for specific details on how to check oil for your machine. Okay, and there'll be some guidelines in there. If you don't have your manual, then we'd recommend that you uh, obtain another copy of it um, just for uh, other details besides the oil level checking. Okay, so um, really uh, what we're going to do now is check the oil. One of the first things to do is to make sure that the machine is actually on a flat level surface and we would recommend you check the oil prior to use uh, on every occasion. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're actually going to remove the dipstick now. Um, as you can see, you unwind it from the threads, remove the dipstick and you wipe the oil off the dipstick. Okay, the oil that's on the dipstick does not give you a level indication. Once the dipstick's clean, you then reinsert the dipstick. You do not screw the dipstick in, uh, but you do press it up against the, the threads and then remove the dipstick, okay? So what we can see here is a chevroned area and your oil level should be somewhere within that chevroned area. Okay, but we would recommend that you run the machine with the oil level at the maximum mark, which is at the top of the chevron area. Okay, if your oil's low, then uh, you would need to uh, replenish the oil and bring it up to the maximum mark. And um, what we would also strongly recommend is that if you overfill the machine, uh, you should not run the machine. If your oil level's up here somewhere in the dipstick, then you should bring the uh, the machine to us or to your local dealer, uh, and they'll be able to you know draw some of the oil out. It's not correct practice to tip the oil out. If you tip the machine on its side, you, you will potentially cause other other problems. You might get oil in the exhaust or oil in the carburetor. So, um, as I say, the oil will need to be uh, removed by, by a dealer. Okay, what you've got here is uh, the dipstick's uh, cleaned once you've finished. Put it back in the dipstick and, uh, and tighten this up. Okay, that's it. Um, uh, Honda recommends a 10W30, they say 10W30 oil. Um, so, uh, if you're replacing it, then, then fit, fit it with uh, an appropriate oil that's suitable um, to that machine. Okay, thanks for, uh, for watching this clip. Uh, if you've got any questions and you're a local customer uh, to us, then uh, please uh, contact us and we'd be happy to talk you through any further details. Thank you.